it coming. I'm just going to take my jacket off. We're going to be doing some uh, weight training with some cardio power pump, which means you need a pair of light weights. Nothing too heavy because of the size, the amount of repetitions that we're going to be doing. I want you to be safe in the muscle and the joint. Um, just for example, I'm using six pounds. Why is that? Because that's all I have. <laughs> but that's pretty a safe range. Six or below is fine. Anything above that will be a lot of repetition for that size. So with that said, we're going to start with a warm up. So thanks for being here. I'm going to hit the play button. It's a little bit of queen to start you off with. Perfect song. Another one bites the dust, right? <laughs> okay. Whatever that means. Okay, guys, as far as warm-up was, I want you to have nuts in, in your hands right now. We're going to start with a slow squat. We reach those arms all the way up to the ceiling. I want you to come down right towards the floor. I'm going to reach up tall. So get into some length in the back here. And those hip flexors, in case you're sitting at a desk, short foot hip flexors from a chair. It's going to go a little bit quicker. Find the leg and then go up to high. Yep, back down. Got it. And anytime you need, you can take those weights, put them off to the side, and just do body weight training. They'll just as effective. It's gonna rotate for me. I just uh, lift and right. Another one, best of this. <laughs> All right. So we're just gonna rotate here, getting some mobility in the hips and the spine. Get four more. Now we're gonna go back to squat, single count, legs to ceiling, drop and reach up. Look good. Got four more of those. Got two more. Now that twist is going to happen the opposite direction. Yeah, looking good. So I'm going to add a punch with that. You're going to bring your arm across, and you're going to give me a little more depth to the leg and some height as well. Back to those squats. The legs to ceiling. Drop. You get it? You got it. Now when we come on up, I want you to circle those arms. And that's going to warm that rotator cuff. Getting ready to hold some weight. I'm going to go lower to the floor and tap the ground eight times. Six, I'm just getting ready to hit mobility-wise. Right arm's going to punch across. You're going to need four of those. Tap the ground for four. Drop down. Left arm, thank you. Yep, punch across. Four, three, two. We're going to tap down four times. Let's go two on the right. Tap the ground. Two on the left. We're going to single one and one. We're going to go whoop, that down, high and low. Good, last one. Here come those arms up to the ceiling, back to those legs. Good, two more. Now hold your arms up. We're going to take a stretch to the right and left. While you're there, add those legs. So I'm going to do a lat pull, both elbows 90. Good, back on up. Down, back up. Hold right here. Now rotator cuff, elbows go down, pick it up. And that's gonna get warm up top of that shoulder. Good. Got two more. Now take your hands behind your back, anterior delt. Front shoulder, open up your feet. So I'm gonna go a little bit bigger. Rest your hands, low back. Woo! Check the leg, outer thigh, working it. Lift and right, those are abductors, those are fast. Not to see, we're gonna go right now. We're gonna squat and lift, left leg. Once and right leg, one time. Good. Hands are going to go on top of the quads, a little more secure here. Neutral across the body, across the left. Just that left leg, four times. You're going to drop, open it up. Drop, open. Good. So I'm warming up abductor muscles. Opposite side, right leg, squat, open. You got it. We're going to go to circle, alternate, one, one. With each leg, comes those arms. Drop, open. Good, last round of four. Now that outer thigh feels pretty warmed up, so I'm gonna go into a lunge. I need your left leg step to me, and then right leg step. You're gonna come together and apart, good. And with that, I'm gonna open up a little more into a V shape, warming up the shoulders as well. Center, double time for four. Reverse lunge, left leg step back, right side. So my hand goes towards the floor, just to make sure that I'm getting some stretch in the back as well. No arms overhead, last round of four. Good, three. Two, once you've got a pair of weights, guys, please. Extra bonus points if your weights match what you're wearing. Mine do not, mine clash, but that's all right. I guess I get no bonus points. <laughs> so, 
I'm going to start with something real easy. Just a supinated bicep. Supinated means your palm faces upward. And I'm going to go back to lunge that I just had you guys do. The right leg steps to me. Left side. Good. Step front, back. And I just wanted to get a feel for the weight, for the size weight that you're going to hold. We're going to step to the side with a squat. Right leg, left side. Good. Out and in. Woo. Open it. Good for four. Three. Now I'm going to go a little bit bigger with those arms. For head, stop at shoulder. Up, down. The minute your arms go up, your heart rate can follow as well. Good. You got it. Now this turns into a lunge. Right leg step to me. Left side. Woo. Up, down. Shoulders, right? Yep, yep. For four. Three. Put your weights on your quads. Double time squat. Down. We're going to jack both those feet. Out, in. Say, I don't want impact. What do I do instead? Then I'm going to take one leg at a time. That would be right there instead of both. So find what zone you want to be in, whether it's one or two. Walking squat to your right. Two times. Come back. Here's that slow jack twice. Woo. We're going to travel to the left side. Come back. Slow jack. Out. In. So anything that involves the weight like what we're doing, heart rate's going to go up big time. I'm going to make it more. Left arm. Pop it up twice. Switch. Do that again. Left arm. Right arm. So now we're working simultaneously, upper body or body. Remember that jack, arms up, and then push down. Whew. Again, too much, back off with one, one, four, three, two, right arm, right leg, double walk. Yep, yep, Whew. again, up, down, up. So we warmed up shoulders. Working it for this. Here's that jack. Arms, whip, all the way down. Good, two more. Left arm, left leg, two off. Now you're right, now you're jacked. Two of them. Right side walk. Back, jack twice. Now weights on the quad. Two walk. Woo! Back twice again, out. In, ladder walk to your right. Come back, jack twice. Now the lunge I started with, right leg to me up, left leg. Good, one arm at a time. Remember the outer thigh, right leg wide. Left leg, right leg. Left, remember the reverse lunge, step back. One right, one left. So I'm gonna go back to jack. In the middle, they're gonna be quick. Eight, Whew. six, good, four, three, slow that jack down. So this is my transition to get to the lunge on the other side. Left leg, step to me, right side, outer thigh, good, outer thigh. Reverse lunge, reverse, let's do that jack for four. Whew. Ladder walk to your lift, come back, check me, two jacks. I'm going big, I'm gonna try to jump it. Ladder walk. That's not for you. Stay grounded. Got their jump. Vertical. Ladder left. Woo. Two jack. Vertical. Travel right. Come on back. Go again. Now we're gonna lunge backwards. Right side. Left side. Woo. Again. That ought to get your heart rate up. Head and chest that for me. You got it. It's gonna get open. So both feet open it up and tap. Eight. Good. Six. Now we're gonna alternate a hammer curl overhead press. Hammer, press. Try that again. So your hands come under you and then you push straight up. Woo! Take your right leg, lunge back twice. Recognize that move. Hammer, overhead, curl, press, left leg, 
two back. Woo. Hammer, press. So you give me both feet back this time. Yeah. Hammer, press. One, one. Both, six. Woo. Now hammer, stay up. Step touch. Right, left. Arms are up. Heart rate up. Lat pull. That means elbows, 90. Down. Nice job, guys. So I'm working to the upper middle back here. Turning that palm to me. Without losing your cadence. Without losing your timing. The knee comes up. Left, right. Don't overthink this move. It's so easy. Let's so get weirded out about it. Just let it happen. For four, three, in front. It's going to be quick. Left, right. So I brought the arms into a narrow position. Feeling the shoulder. Got it. Eight, seven, six, five. Hang with me. Kick. Front kick. Left, right. Woo. Yeah. Keep that going. We're going to go back to a quick knee. Watch my arms. I'm going to open it up. Hold here. Elbow opposition to knee. Oh, that's brutal. Going to feel the pecs kick in. Engaging all to the top. Shoulder, anterior delt. Step touch. Arms up. Chest press. Over the head. Yeah. Chest press. Feel free to yell, scream, on the groan. Whatever it gets you to. Make sure who's in your house, though, right? Bring your arms back. Tricep. So important to balance out your muscles when you're working out. Not always the same thing. So now I'm hitting the rears. Back of the shoulder. My triceps. What's coming back? Weight's on. Remember the outer thigh had to do? Warm up. Woo. Side to side. Lift that leg away from the body. Eight. Six. I'm going to slow this down half time. It's my left leg. Out and in. Hands by your shoulder. Arnold press. That means it's a vertical line. Straight up. I'm going to go big at the bottom. Tap down for eight. Six is saying that's not that big. You'll see where I'm getting at. Four more. We're going to bring the weight by your shoulder. So we're going to climb the ladder. Right outer thigh. Bring it out. Whew. So I'm just building a combination here. Push up and down. Good. Four more. Three. Two. Go back down. Double time on the outside. That's called a dead squat. Frame in your legs. Here's my combo. I'm going to put the weight down. Step back in the left leg. Come on up. Step back in the right leg. So it's four parts. One, two, three, back up. Do that again with the head and chest always elevated. What I'm getting ready for are both feet. Same time. Stop. Come on up. You're gonna hit me grown. Yep. Again. Back. One more. Right knee. Arms up. Left knee. Up and down. Woo. Big moves right here using large quads, hamstrings, large muscle group. Weight to floor. Both feet. Four. Three. Two. Just your weight flip. Shoulder. Head. Go back again. Just the weight. Shoulder. Head. Now your legs. Hop back. Four. Three. Two. Here come those weights. Shoulder, tap down. One more. Legs, hop back twice. Whew. Here come the arms, guys. For head, legs back. Two times. Arms, hold them up. Lap pull, right leg squat. Four times. Good, three. We're gonna switch, opposite leg with that big step. Woo! Yeah. Two times. Right leg. Good. Now we switch to left. It's that wide opening arm. Right again. Step. Good. Change up. 
Get ready, guys. Here comes this single. One, one. Woo. You say my shoulders are dying. Then bring it down. We're going to go to biceps. Purposely take it out. You got it. Remember the jumping jack. Four times right now. It's called a skate lunge. Right, left arm and leg. Drop. Or quick jack. Four. Or right tap. Skate right, left. Four. Three. Jack or tap. Whoop. Left side drops. Alternate. Left. Right. Jack or tap. Four. Three. Skate your right, please. Nice job, guys. Jack. Twice. Skate left, right. Back two. Eight right. Back two. Eight. Last one. Now walking squat to me, right and left. Walk, walk. Top the ground. Drop. Hammer curled. You're gonna go under and over. Rest. One more time. Put your weight on the leg. Back it up on the right. Whoop. It's gonna get bad. One, burpee. Arms, overhead twice. Wait for it, burpee one. Back, overhead, press. Weights go down, drop the drop. Whew. Bring it up twice. Now I'm gonna add on this. The outer side that we got ready, add it here. Right outer side, left leg. Burpee, one. Left outer thigh. Bring it up. Right leg. Burpee one. Walk, squat to the right. Two walk. Woo! Do it again. Lateral two, two. Here come those arms. Straight up and down for four. Big press. Three, good. Two, here's a lateral to the left. Two walks. So all that. So you're gonna push off that leg. Here come the arms. Up and down. Woo! Now that knee that I had before, coming at you. Left knee once. Slow jack once. Right knee. Slow jack, yeah. Knee again. Up. Jack, one more time. Skate lunge. Left, right, a little longer. Eight. Six. Four. Three. Find the floor and tap. Eight. Six. Hear the music? I'm going with it. Burpee. One. Drop. Three more, just like that. Back. Stand and palm. I modify right here. One more. Right knee up once. Slow jack one. Left knee up. Slow jack. Good. Right again. Big reach. Up. Last one. Now that walking squat to me. Left leg walk. Left. Right. Jack in and out twice. Back it up. Left leg walk. Left. Jack in and out. We're going to stay here. Watch my hand. I'm going to reach. Back. Up. Woo. So I'm just overload a little bit more so that I'm down. I'm going to keep the core tight. If you can, both arms, legs, four, seven, six, five, four, three, hold it here. We're going to swing to the right, swing left. Woo! So bring your weights together. Give me that kind of like a shovel shot. You're going to bring it to the side. Ready to do any golf, any tennis, anything where there's a rotational, functional move the middle line of the body. Yep, yep, come on. Push. Drive it across. Four. Three. I want you to lunge to me. Right leg, arms up. Lunge it left. So it comes thrown over my shoulder like you're shoveling. Pick it up. We're not going to say that word, though, right? <laughs> now for the next couple months. Bring it across. Great way to work. Opposition. Woo. Up, down. Now I'm going to grab a weight in each hand. You're going to face me, and I'm going to hammer curl. That means my thumb is up. Jumping jack. Slow, up and down. Push. Seven. Six. Nice and big. Four more. 
three. Now take your left leg, cross behind with a bicep, four of them. Good. Same leg outer thigh, arms go over the head. In point, you get some muscle work in there, and that's exactly what we're doing here. Two times, curtsy tap, step back. There's that outer thigh twice. Woo! Curtsy behind. Sink in, outer thigh, and here it coming. One, one, cross. Pick it up, yep, yep. Back behind you, and a vertical line. Woo! Got one more to go. Now that leg lunges to me, left side. Slow jack once, left leg lunge. There's a cardio pop to it, after the muscle. One, I'm gonna put it all together. Curtsy, left leg back, outer thigh. Lunge to me, twice, and I'm gonna jack for four. Woo, nice job guys. Same leg, curtsy behind, outer thigh. Lunge just once, jack just once. Curtsy back, outer thigh. Lunge to me, jack. We're gonna do it again. Why is that? I wanna make sure that I hold it. Wanna make sure that you feel the muscle work in its entirety. Curtsy back, outer thigh. Lunge to me, slow jack comes, jack. Woo! Yeah, hold her down. Never my modification, I would just tap right here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, slow jump once. Slow jack. Out, and you're gonna push up, jack. Two more times, big reach. Woo. One more, you're saying, what about the other side? That's our right leg, step back, cross. So notice I'm not twisting, I want you to face me. Here's that outer thigh, arms up, right leg. Woo. Strong extension. Good back to that cross. Sink in, your glutes. Three parts that make up that muscle. Targeting all three right now. Outer thigh four. Rest. I call it a family of three. Party of three in your glutes. Two, sit back. Down. Outer thigh twice. Woo. Crawl behind. Think. All that repetition on that one side. Should be feeling it. Two for two. Outer thigh. Now remember the lunge I had. Step to me on the light. Go jack. Step to me. I'm gonna go with the music. Hang with me. Quick jack. Four, three, vertical, pop it. My right leg, cross back once. Outer thigh, lunge to me. Slow jack once. Cross, right leg, outer thigh. Lunge to me, slow jack. There's a lot going on, cross. That's what I'm calling it for you, outer thigh. It's tricky to remember all that, right? That jack, work quick, work quick. Woo. Eight, right, left, lunge. Four, quick jack, open. So the left leg starts to skate. Then to come to me on that skate. Back it up. So a little dynamic moves like this, great for the body to travel. Come to me, come on. Back up, feet are wide, lean and press, yeah. And you tap down, again. One, two, three, and back down. Woo! Gonna give me one more. The weight stays on the floor. Eight circle jumps, big arms. Woo. All the way up, little banana rama. Come on, big reach. One more. With any great workout, couple push-ups with it. Bear crawl, walk to me, right side, lift, push up twice, not a lot, shoulder tap, cross that arm, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, push up. I'm gonna add on to the two to make it four. Last one, walk your hands in for four. Circle jump, two times, guess what, it's a bear crawl, walk it. Functional move, push up, down. I'm going for the number four. 
And I'm going to add those shoulder taps again. Cross. Woo. Push up. Down up. You got it. Yeah, baby. Here comes that shoulder tap. Little guys. Eight of them. Six. Four. Three. Walk your hands in, please. Circle jump. One time. Now grab your weight and bring it to your legs. Circle jump one. And then you're going to go without them. So it's a combination. Without the weight. And grab. Yeah, baby. Drop the hips rather than the chest. Head up. Chest up. Woo! Three. Circle jump. No weight. Just your body. Come on. One more. One more. Grab the weight. Oh. Three. Circle. Body weight. Now I'm going to reverse this. Sinking cap on. Grab your weight. You're going to lift up. Three times. Two. Put it down. Now you circle jump. Grab three. Good. Yeah, gotta use your push a little bit on that one. Yep. Leave and circle. One, one. Grab. Leave it. Grab it. Uh, all the way. The butt is low. Squeeze. Come on. This one, I want you to grab the weight. All the way up over the head. Quick knee. Right. Left. Right. Left. Arms in the mix. Come on, nice and strong. Like someone's going to punch in the gut. Kick it to me. I don't care how high it is. As long as you get in flexion in the quad. Yep. Four. Three. Here comes the knees now. Woo. Keep that going. Three. Right knee. On four. I am going to kick it. Left side. Three. Two, one, kick. Really hard to maintain your balance. As fast as you can. Three, two. Now with the knee and a kick on the right. Left, knee, kick. Oh, man. Woo. Brutal. Step, touch. Arms over the head. Uh, one more. Take your arms above the head. What are we looking for? A little bit of tricep action. So I'm going to bend the elbows, down and up. Now we're going to revisit that knee. It's going to feel weird to you, because the timing is going to be different. It's going to go down, back up. Now I want you to pull slower to the knee, right? Left. So it's standing, weight. Strong in the core there. Like someone punch you, right in the gut. Yep. Woo! Add some speed, guys. They're small. Eight. Six. Four. Slow down. Right to left. Strong to the top. Let that length in the middle. Yep, get that range. Back to the small freeze. Woo! Step touch. Arms need it. Bicep. Oh. Say, how's that any better? It's really not. Just changes the angle muscle. <laughs> Overhead. One time. Bicep one. Bam to bam. Yep. Two more. Woo. Last one. Back of the arm's going to get it now. Tricep. Lean forward. Push. Nice job, guys. Now put your hands on your back and open up the feet. Move that tap. You'll see where I'm going to go. Now go into a lunge so that foot is in contact. Take your weight on the leg, and I'm going to start to reach, one arm at a time. So I'm going into a lunge here, one, can you walk to me, so we're going to do walk and bear crawl with the weight, renegade row, right arm up, left arm up, butt stays low, strong, as you pull it in, watch my right leg, lunge to me, then I want you to row once, try it again, right leg, step, Row. Again, step. Row. Last one. Now just your feet are going to jack for me on the toes. Woo! Nice and light. First muscle that's tight is the core. You've got eight, six. Now your left leg can lunge. Show me that row. Step. Row. Try that again. Step. Row. 
two more times. Woo! Last one. Here comes that jack on the toes. Four of them. Just hit move. Wide hop twice. Woo! Four jacks. We're in the thick of it right now. Wide hop. Hold your feet wide. Leave your weight. Check my arms. Feeling ground. Ah. Down. So there's the elevation again. Getting the heart rate up. Woo. And you give me one more by adding a circle jump and then tap. Up, down. If that's too much, stay grounded. You don't have to jump. Four. Three. I want you to grab the weight, please. From here, slowly overhead. Tap down. Up again. I'm going to back up a little bit. You can see what's going on. And my screen is angled. I'm going to do it one more time. So leave the weight. It's two. Circle jump. Woo! Grab your weight. Two by two. All the way up. Circle jump twice. Yep. Grab it. Here's the tough one. One circle jump. Weight goes to the legs. Again. One goes up. Woo! Big reach. Last one. Take your weight with me. Step touch by step. Yep, 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 yep. This is a type A song for sure. Get up and down. Keep those elbows in. Got it. Two more. I need that right leg to lunge to me. Front to back. Front to back. So I want the heart rate to go up higher for you. So I'm going to go over the head now. Four. Three. Two. It's four quick jacks on the toes. Four. Remember the burpee? Just once. Down and back. Four. Quick jack. Open. Burpee. One. So left leg lunge swim. Five steps. Going to go under. Good. Now here come those long arms over the head. Four times up. Whew, big reach. Yeah. Nice job. Jack for four. Open. Burpee. One. Jack again for four. Woo. Here's that burpee one. Right leg. Lunge to me. Bicep. Four. Good. You got it. Three. Two. Remember those arms straight up to the ceiling. Four. It's the same sequence. It's revisiting. Yeah. Jack. Four. Open. Here's that burpee one. Woo. Last round. Four. Jack. Four. Now that burpee one, left leg, bicep, left to me, four, tuck the elbows in, good, here comes that straight arm up, big reach, woo, bring it to here we go, oh, two jacks, two jumps, and it's one burpee please, woo, two jacks, you want to get a little something bigger, vertical jump, you want to go a little more challenged here. Straight lunge, right, left, eight, six. Remember the clean and press. Feet wide, clean and press, drive. One more, your left arm starts. Eight, lunge, eight, six, four, three, clean and press. Woo, do that again, catch under. The skate happens in four. Four, three, clean and press one. Catch. Good. Skate on the left, please. Down. Clean and press. Now I'm going to stay here. Watch my arms. Outer thigh right. Outer thigh left. One, one. Any leg, any weight. So good for the body to do. Tap the floor for four. Clean and press, right leg outer. Then my interim is that tap for four. Down, and that left leg outer thigh. Woo. Walk to me, bear crawl. Yeah. Take a right knee out wide, and cross. So you're suspending that leg. Yeah. Uh-huh, two more. It's a wide hop. One time, push up. Wide hop one. 
Now, if that's too much, you just tap the foot here, and I can hold a push-up. I don't have to do it. Wide hop. Now with the left knee, out and down. We do those to work the obliques again. Side of the waist, a little bit of glute work as well. Thanksgiving's coming, right? This is good. Step work. Yep. One more. Wide hop once. Push. Watch my renegade roll. Left arm, right arm. Wide hop one. Push one. Renegade row. And I'm going to have you grab a mat, please. Keep your weights with you. You want to make sure we do some core stuff here as well. So weights with you. I'm going to have you start off sitting on the mat, please. Now you can't see me. I'm going to pull my mat back a little bit. So you're going to start with a weight. How about just one? And I'm going to have you go up and out. So it's a quick move. It's up, push back. Up, push back. Now my one weight is going to be vertical. And I chose that position to be a little bit easier on the wrist flexor. Yep. Up, back. So shoulder height, push. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. We're going to add some rotation in the body. So it's going to be a Russian twist. So I want you to roll back. You're going to feel the elbow contact. What I'm doing there is work it into the hip flexor and into back. But I don't want to do that too long. I'm going to come on up. Let's rotate here. A little bit. I'm going to have you throw the weight. And use your hand as a backboard. Now, we're not going too big on your throws. I want to make sure you can catch it. Good. Roll back. Still with that throw. Eight. Look at all the muscle that has to kick in to grab the weight. Sit up a little bit higher, please. Watch my throw. I'm going to go higher and then come down lower. Little hand back coordination, right? Yep, yep. Top. So when you're doing anything fitness wise, it's important to always change things up. I mentioned that before. Creativity, variety is so important for the muscle and mentally for you to stay in the game. Who wants to do the same thing if they get bored, right? Nope. A little quicker, a little smaller for me. Woo! And maybe you got some aggression in you. Maybe a little bit stressed out from everything going on. So I'm going to have you go for four more. And the weight goes down. Put it on down. Hit me with some punches. Sitting tall. So this is take out the aggression. Halfway drop it. Come on up quick. Cool. We're going to go through just a series here of levels and of speeds. Right now I'm seated tall. Four. Three. I'm going to come back low, and I'm going to bring my elbows tight, tight, tight. Woo! It's a quick rotation. Eight, seven, six, five, four. I'm going to slow this down. Watch. I'm going to go up high and drop the elbow. Drop down. Woo! We're all through that little oblique. Side that way. Good. Reach. Back down. I'm going to come back down low, quick again. Eight. Six, four, can you give me a punch? Straight on out. Eight, six, last four. Come on up, grab one weight, guys. Gonna roll back. Hips are gonna come up, so we're gonna open up the flexors by two of the arms. Sit all the way up. So what I'm doing there is just in disengaging the hip flexors. They're working through the core. Yep. Now keep your weight up, but I want you to draw one knee at a time, lift and lower, without letting your glute touch, knee drive, four, go, three, two, now I want you to drop your hips, and you're going to go both legs up, bend your elbows, and draw, in and out, yep, Whew. so that's a reverse curl, when you're working the arms and the legs at the same time, coming up and down, for four, three. Now I'm going to add the leg extension on the arms. You're going to curl in, out, and press out. Four more. That head can stay down if you need. Now hold it in. It's a double time crunch. Eight, seven, 
Second round of eight. Minimizing the distance between your elbows and the knees. Four, three, two, out and in, please. Out, in. Try to touch elbows. Right to leg. Woo. Four, three, super set. Everybody, roll your body up. Put the weight down. Turn around. Want you to face the mat, guys. Walking plank. Elbows are going to come down. Come back. A strong core, which is what we're working on now, important for every muscle in the body. Keep your back in a safe place. And close all the muscles, front, side, and back. You got it. Now I want you to stay on the elbows and up to my arm. These are called shoulder abductors. That means the arm comes away from the body. Ugh. They're brutal. Come to your knees if you need. There is nothing with that. I want you to be strong and safe in the back. And whatever position you need to maintain, you do. Last four. Remember I said a super set. So we're going to go back to the other exercise. Flip it for me. Very effective way to train. On your back. So this is going to be a fast bicycle. Front, back, front. Now my cadence, my speed is quick for a reason. Come on. Push, front, back, foot. If you need to minimize, make it smaller. But I need strength here. Ready? Set. Slow this down in step. One. One. Lashing the muscle. Three to it. Woo. Good. Four. Three. Two. Roll your body up. Flip it. Second round. Boy, there will be two. Gonna walk the plank again on those hands. Elbows down. Do that again. Down. Down. Hand goes under the shoulder. Woo. You got two more to go. Walk it down. Last one. Take your hand to the quad. Pike it up. One push or hold. Other side pike. Push or hold. You got two more. They're going to flip it back in the back. Last one. Okay, flip it on over. And now we had to do those fast bicycles. That means right here. Quick, quick, quick. How you get there, that's called transitional strength. That's what's important when we get in between each move the next round. Six, five, four, three. Feet are going to come down. I'm going to cross chop. Slow it first. When you get it, I'm going to go quicker right here. So music drives us, it gives us the energy to complete through the routine, whatever exercise you're on. Med ball throws. Grab a ball, give it. Bam, back down, throw. I'll give everything you got in that throw. And when this is the last thing that you're going to do, 100%. Come on, throw it. If you can, find your knee. Yeah, back down. Say, why would I want to do that? Because it makes it a little bit harder. Or you can stay down here. If you don't want to go all the way up, right there is fine. Shorter range. Keep that going, guys. Four. Three. Two. Now, once you throw diagonal, go into the corner. Other corner. Six, change your number. Hand to fist. Double time and pulse. Woo. You're aiming right for the midline of the knees. Shoulder blades up. Eight. Six, four, three, walk your feet out, roll your body all the way up slow. Arms stay up, roll back for me. Keep them up, keep them up. Roll the body up, come on. It's so hard to balance that. Keep them up. Not done. So all the muscles that you work in the back extensors, the core here, the flexors. Halfway hold, five. Six, take your right knee up. Take your left knee. Open up those arms. Hello, hello, I've left you unsuspended. That's purposely. We're gonna crunch in, bring it out. In, back out. 
over the head, let the elbows touch, seven, six, five, almost there, four, three, two, and you are out. Lay back, awesome guys, nice job. Hips up, so that's a bridge to open up hip flexors, arms above your head, let your fist to your hand just rest on the ground, that's a great. Drop your butt, arms to one side, hips to the other. It's gonna get a good stretch, lumbar, low back. Let's switch, opposite side. So from the impact training that we did, I want you to decompress your spine. So draw your knees into your chest and get some space there. Just feel pretty good. Flex your heels, press to the ceiling. I just want you to dorsal flex, plant our flex. All that means is stretching, strengthening shin to calf. A little bit of caffeine, increase that speed, front to back. Great way to strengthen the muscles right around the shin the bone, the tibia bone. Last eight, six, four, three, one foot down, hamstring. Important to make sure that you have stretch in the back of the leg, directly correlated to your lower back. Switch sides, please. All right, I want you to draw your knees into your chest. Take a roll up, acclimate, make sure you feel okay. Turn around for me, down dog. Love the stretch. Get some length in the hamstrings, your muscles, your back. Walk the hands in, pressing the head, the shoulders down. Bend your knees slowly, a right below your calf. A ah, little Bon Jovi. Walk it in. Elbows rest. Round your backbone halfway. It's gonna come all the way up. You're gonna face me. I was like to judge our workout on how high your hair looks at the end, but I can't see your hair, so I'm sure it's looking also like it works hard, opposite arm to leg, and then switch. Step behind. Mine always looks a little scary. Look at those feet, nice and big. Arms as well. So retraction, open up the chest. Good, tip forward, one more hamstring stretch just while we're standing here. Support the spine, roll up slowly, shoulders, a little tricep from those push-ups that we did, those punches. Opposite side. Good. Feet together. Last inhale, palms up. Exhale. Thanks for coming tonight. You guys did an awesome job. Nice work. And I will